Hi, thanks for joining me. We are starting on the kitchen. Uh, my game plan is to do the big rooms first and then work on coming back and detailing the little sections. Which is usually not my norm. Usually I do uh, one one room at a time in, uh, I guess, I forget what I'm trying to say. Anyway, I usually don't bunny hop from room to room, but uh, since I'm trying to mimic something that exists, via pictures. I only have pictures to go off of the big rooms, the main rooms, like the kitchen, the bedroom, and so on. Uh, so I'm just going to have to fill it in with the with my imagination for the other stuff. And so in order to do that, I need to finish the big rooms to see what I have. Before I started doing for YouTube and play, and I was playing House Whipper, one of the common things I would do while I was playing House Whipper was listen to audiobooks. And then uh, I, I actually really didn't have much attention on putting uh, House Whipper on YouTube, but I hadn't realized that there was a big demand for it either. So since there was a demand, then I, of course, was giving more videos uh, and was happy to because you guys incentivize me to keep... Uh, playing and, and being creative and think of new ideas. Uh, but kind of funny is that because I've stopped listening to audiobooks so much, uh, I kind of got out of the the audiobook news because uh, I used to be like deeply ingrained in that <laughs> and podcasts as well. Uh, just listening strangely enough, to a podcast talking about Audible and how it's uh, really awful to authors. Their authors aren't making any money off of it. Uh, they require such a commitment or else they give up like 70% of their income. And uh, just uh, by happenstance, I know a few people who make a living off of doing uh, voice acting for audio audiobooks. <laughs> can't imagine... I know that they make a lot of money doing that. Ooh, are we considering you two deep or one deep? You guys didn't see me put this in. I actually forgot to start the recorder. Uh, this is the half wall from the workshop. Yes. Oh, I did watch the House Flipper, the Frozen District's House Flipper at the video that they did talking about the upcoming House Flipper 2. And one of the things that they had talked about was the fact that in House Flipper 1, we can only put walls that are vertical like this. We can't uh, do horizontal walls. 
half walls, like the lower half walls. And uh, apparently House Flipper 2 is going to bring, give us the ability to do that, which is great. I still don't understand what the limitation is in giving us lower half walls. They can give us upper half walls. They should be able to give us lower half walls. But that's just me. to find time you these are these new I don't recognize them. I don't think they're new because they're towards the bottom I must have had them they're new right I don't remember these Now I'm starting to question everything that's life. I would hate this rock because it looks dirty to me. commit to the whole floor. Part of me wants to use the Imbus wood cabinets. They actually do match what all the <laughs> um, uh, pictures that I'm seeing. Only problem with the Imbus set 
do not have all the pieces that are going to like this set. I don't think I have any practical use for it, right? There's some really cute coverings here in this snowman wooden that I don't see elsewhere. Sort of this light one here with these little circles. There'd be some cute uses for that. Oh, cute, this little flower. The spare bloom. What? They have some of these cute patterns and we don't get them anywhere else? What? Oh shit. Can still fit. I think there's in there too. Standard fridge. 
put a bucket here. What does it look like from the back? Aesthetic, Mr. Refrigerator. Here, I could fit. Favorite. Favorite fridge. Why do I do this this to myself? I make this. Choices so difficult and they don't need to be do and then get mad at myself. Okay, do the fridge is no longer open? Is that opened? By everyone. Check. I could, or I open fridges. the small fridge is open. No. No, that does not. swore there was vanilla fridges because I would put food in them.
でー。Essentially, ignore the Curiosity, let's go and take a see how awful it looks. Eat it. Don't eat it. I'm alright with it.
<laughs> Not quite centered over that, but I'm gonna live with it. Call it good. I think I like it. here. My plan was to put wood over this side.
That was the image I had in my head. I don't know if I love it or not, but I'm going to roll with it for right now. I thought this uh, came in a darker brown. But then if you're not seeing it in that Florida. Oh, uh oh, Oreo. We'll do what? Oh, see, that makes me think. Cabin. Not going for a cabin. I'm gonna try a mess. I think it's. No, I can already tell it's too yellow. And I'm not 100% sure if I'm in love with this color contrast here, but I'm going to try to be in love with it. It's dark brown. Being blind. Okay. And I could have sworn there was. It was just in a different part. I don't know why I summoned so many, but.
ruin my plans. Well, whoever's going back there is skinny. in some of the stupidest ways. But I'm living with it. It's fine. <laughs> Alright, do I like that color wood or do I want a darker one? I think I want a darker one. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just laughing. Stupidity of it all. <laughs> Oh, that actually was my darkest. Oh, no, bird boot. Walk through.
You know what? I put those down and I actually want to put rubs down. I probably screwed myself over on that. Oh no! I'm so sorry, Plant. I don't know what happened. You got smushed. Oh, I'm not mad about it. Okay. I do prefer those. The uh, other one looks it's thickly in the light. Okay. Back to rug. I really should use this rug granny. That's actually a common rug that I kept seeing, a color assortment that I kept seeing in the pictures, but I don't think I physically can put that rug down. It is so ugly. <laughs> Paint the ceiling. I do. I'm gonna save you guys the torture of that. I will be back in a Welcome back. Barcells. I would kill for an eyedropper tool. I don't know about you guys, but just the yeah, eyedrop a piece of furniture so I don't have to go hunting for it. I did see someone ask on Reddit if there was a way to favor an item, and I was like, that is so smart. I wish there was. I hate the fact that you can't walk through there, but at the same time, it looks so good.
should have sold that. I should have kept it because I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. I have to chant to myself, move, don't sell, whenever I get a bright idea to do something. Constantly sell the item and then I have to go find it and buy it back if I don't like what I was doing. Oh, I just realized I should really use these chairs here. No wicker. That was a common, common thing I also saw. I had the idea, and now I don't like it now that I summoned it. Uh, it'd be wild to do one of the different colors. No, it does match. It matches the color. Yeah, overhead ceiling lamps. Something uh, big and <laughs> these diamond ones are also. I see variations of those in those pictures. to use this. But let's give it a try. Pink? Will it be pink or will it look more brassy? Oh, but it hangs so very low. But I... Born. Right, no, let's not use the flamethrower. Give you guys a sneak peek one of the futuristic or not futuristics one of the new modern houses i'm going to turn it into a bar slash casino i have a lot of plans for that so hey hopefully a little sneak peek on that Go down the stick. Whoever made those align, uh, 
devices, I love you. I just, I want you to know that. You, you are adored. <laughs> In case you haven't heard it. You have, you have come through for me more than once. Okay, so, coming upstairs, we're gonna there. Here, we'll uh, here. Still don't know if the table calls for three lamps, but... decide if I like that. I'm not so sure. But, okay. We can add time. doesn't, dude? Who doesn't? I need a place for my science magazine? For your science magazine. You do not look like a dude who reads science magazine.
but I was a guest. I would be at the perfect height to knock myself into the temple and give myself a concussion. Perfect. Seeing that picture up that high makes me think of my mother when she uh, first married my dad and was getting introduced uh, to uh, family. Uh, she made a comment before they were ever married. Uh, she made a comment about how uh, one of my aunts, actually everybody in the family to be honest, how everybody in the family kept putting their pictures all the way to the ceiling and it bugged the crap out of her. <laughs> then it bugged him because she said something. But but then but then <laughs> um, it, he would realize the more that I looked that she was actually right. <laughs> they did put all the stuff all of their pictures towards the ceiling. <laughs> and the thing is, is that family is very short. They're just very confused. <laughs> You'd think as a family of short people, you would put the pictures much lower. But someone, someone must have taught them that they need to go towards the ceiling. remind myself don't detail out until you have everything in place because uh, luxury likes to be problematic for me when I start to detail things out why but hates it but I'm fingers crossed I haven't noticed the same kind of problems that I I've noticed last and uh, it's making me hope that they fixed some of those problems. Stop. I was about to detail it out. Just said. Those open. That open. So I've got the family dining area for quick dining. I have the formal dining uh, for entertainment. I have the kitchen, which I still have to dress down and sell out. You guys need to let me know in the comments, pretty please. Do you like watching me? detail things out and when I mean detailing things out putting the vases the florals the knickknacks on the shelves uh, that kind of thing uh, books um, or would you just rather see the end product because detailing takes me a long time to... it just does uh, and if you would rather skip that and just see the end product like you know, all these little things uh, great, I'll give you that. <laughs> like when I detail these shelves out like this. I don't want to... I want to give you ideas and hopefully uh, inspire you to build in House Flipper, but I don't want to bore you to tears by watching me do all of this stuff. The garage. 
I do want to make a little nook in the garage for washroom. Which I'm still un horribly undecided on what. did not see uh, in a lot of the pictures wallpaper being done. And I guess I should mention too, uh, there is uh, different pictures of Frank Lloyd Wright that I'm trying to follow. There is ones that he sold commercially uh, for like hotels and that office buildings, those kind of things. Uh, there's those. Then there's those that he sold to everyday families, which I actually am not following those because those have changed generational hands and have taken apart a lot of his original artwork as, uh, or his original architectural designs. Uh, I am trying to stay faithful to uh, like his, his museum style ones that are being preserved. I think I am done for now. shelves into that section right there. I decide if I want to move forward by one. Yes. I kind of like it. Did my camera go? It made me a little dizzy. I'm gonna bring one more forward. Go with that. Walking in circles. I don't mean to. I'm just trying to decide where do I want to put the pillars. I don't want to put one in there, but I'm not going to. That means I would have to move benches, and I don't. Want Part of me. So originally, when I put these benches down. I was thinking center to this door. I wanted to give them the ability to look out. But when I come, when I approach from this side, I sort of want it to be centered against this. 
But no, I think I want it centered against the door. Stick with my plan. Okay, I think I'm gonna stop here. Um, I got through the kitchen and the dining room. Uh, up next is going to be detailing the other rooms. I guess let's walk through it real quick, uh, get the idea firm in my head. So detailing up here and down here, this is all going to be a sitting room. A one big, just multiple sitting rooms. I think I'm going to build uh, bookshelves into here and do a bunch of books, like a bunch of books. A little mini library, a sitting nook against here, all the way around. Uh, did I? I don't think I did. No, I don't. I thought about putting a door here, but I figured it's not necessary. It can come in through this way. So yeah, a reading nook here. Uh, built-in bookshelves here. Maybe another little, uh, little round table and a thing there. So then that will round that out. I still gotta detail the bedroom. I still gotta find some Asian, uh, pictures. Like those. I gotta do something over there. Oh yeah, I was undecided what I was gonna do here. I was leaning towards building in uh, bookshelves for a reading nook or doing a collage of uh, Japanese art. I was undecided. Alright, and then I gotta do the entryway this entryway here to the garage laundry room and workroom in the garage is my plan there with some cars and then if the game doesn't break on me then i will do some uh sitting areas out on the balconies and out here look at those oh in the windows looking in not digging those i thought about putting shades in all the windows but I decided not to. I'm gonna, for everyone... Look. Look, the patch is see-through. I did. <laughs> Go in real quick. Hold on. Oh, it disappeared. Okay, no, we gotta look again. Hold on, we gotta look again. <laughs> How does this game break in these ways <laughs> i fall through stairs <laughs> stairs disappear <laughs> the uh patch through the window is visible even though we've clearly <laughs> done the wall <laughs> i love it i love it i love this game so much <laughs> anyway <laughs> um I do want to make a few little like sitting areas out here, maybe an outdoor bar with some of the uh, workshop items that we have is my thought process with that. I'm not cutting down any trees. I'm leaving the trees as is. But yeah, that's where I'm sitting with that. Uh, thank you guys so much for keeping me company. And I will be back soon with more. Again, please let me know in the comments if you want to see the full detailing of me laying down every nook and cranny. Uh, or knick-knack, I mean, because I, I gladly will. I'll share that with you. I just don't want to bore you out of your minds. So, yeah, all right. I will be back soon.